Hey guys, I'm Bobo the Vulture. It's time to enter Vault 619. And once we do, we got work to do. We need extra caps. We can sell weapons and outfits. It'll be a good thing to do. Let us quick, fast, in a hurry. I maybe should have found out who those babies are. I didn't think Elil Bronco was old enough for cartoons. Well, Bronco isn't, but uh, certainly his parents are old enough for cartoons. Fair point. Quit bothering me with these details about how there's not enough power or water. I love uh, the super fast living lap of everybody. How are we doing for... We need some... Uh, that's right, we need some right away because we ran across some stupid... Kyle Kevin. We ran across some Dagom... You'll get live in water when the overseer deems you ready for live in power. Hey, that unlocked us a room, guys. Things are looking up. Plus, we crafted three rare weapons. We have a trophy of Weaponsmith. And here come raiders. Sell four pieces of junk. I could do that. At least raiders are easy. Yeah, raiders are uh, no trouble. Not gonna waste some time running around here, Always but uh, happy to see raiders attacking my vault. Honestly, they're just a source of low-level equipment. You want some basic guns? And a few caps. Yeah, and some money. Alright, no time to start a family because there's an incident in the vault. Oh, that means the person I just tried to transfer over is not going to get over there either. Guys, there's no there's no way to dramatically die back there. Please, just come to the foreground and collapse. You're not going to collapse in a dog pile with the other ones? This is an independent-minded raider. <clears throat> there you go. Anytime. That raider had a recipe for a pressurized flamer. That seems worthwhile. That's a pretty nice weapon. Oh, can't start a family. There's no more room in the vault. Well, now you're just making me sad. Let's uh, make some room in the vault, everybody. The Just put another living quarters in here, sure. The fourth trimester. Yeah. Vault is full. We're just going to... We're just going to keep things like this. Let's upgrade. And upgrade again. Should have upgraded this one. Well, 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 if it isn't MR stream way earlier than normal. Yeah, that's exactly who it is. My folks just call me, uh, Ricky. 
Ricky streams way earlier than usual. Could have been Richard. You know what I'm saying? How deserve? You have maximum strength and agility. We'll just call you Dick. You're just kind of moving your way down, so... Sure. Why don't you come down to the endurance room? You just seem to be a hey, new guy in town. You have maximized your strength and endurance already. Let's see. One, two... Four, five, six. Maxed out in Luckland there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I got as many people as we can in there. Let's bring you in here to get smart. You have maximum strength and endurance too. Why don't you come up here and learn Perceptione? Now then, Mega McGee, Shaker McGee, and Wolfman Kevin's child. Wicked smart. Yeah, wicked smart. I got a number. How do you like them apples? So now we can unlock water purification, which I'm not actually super wild on. I'm not super wild on getting water or purification because we're almost to getting a Nuka-Cola bottler at this point. And that will give us water and food. Applesauce, bitch. Yeah, we don't have enough money to uh, level up any of our nuclear reactors. We might have earlier. Hello, Grace. You're the only one who doesn't know. But will the Nuka Cola bottler give you pay to win buck? I mean, nothing's going to give me pay to win bucks. Nice job, Raymond Leverstroke. You're doing the Lord's work here. What is your expertise? Your expertise is agility, so we should try putting you in a food room later. We'll give you a handyman jumpsuit for that purpose. Is this nice to all the dwellers? All the female ones, yes. I'm exactly as nice as this. At least the ones who are not my children, which is most of them. Nuka Cola Bottler takes endurance, by the way. Yes, it does take endurance. And, uh, that's another one of the reasons to get all of your new, you know, children of the sun, uh, all endurance up whenever possible. Four. Do I have any more, uh, kids just hanging out here now? You guys are in the barracks, but okay. We have nobody left who's on coffee break. We just had one kid who grew up. We got a lot of babies wandering around here. Anyhow, let's take a quick look and see what uh, is going on in this friendly settlement that we are going to help. This was a daily quest, as I recall. Let's talk to them settlers. How are you enjoying, Catan? Not enough wood? Too many sheep? Or... Too, too much wood and not enough sheep. It's the classic problem in 
insert name of rural community you don't like. Rocks. Rock. So as you get turned around in here, you've already come to one branching path. Room full of nothing. Room full of a pretty chintzy gun. Caden jokes are hexing though. Too much for dem sheeps. Classic Scottish Kiwi problem. Two words, fine booty. You know, I wasn't going to say it about my raiding party, but uh, if they're going to say it about themselves, they can go right ahead. And it's kind of funny you mentioned the Kiwis, uh, I guess. I don't know if you guys remember the... Uh, the classic WWF slash WWE tag team known as the Bushwhackers. But, um... They worked for many years doing basically the same gimmick, but as the New Zealand Sheep Herders. And when I say the exact same gimmick, I mean... The Bushwhackers. They looked the same, they swung their arms around, they did all whatever stuff. <laughs> but they beat the crap out of people and got really bloodied. Haha, ha, I knew where this was going. What, about the New Zealand sheep herders? Sure. I mean, that's the Kiwi problem. Hey there, Moose Skins. We didn't think you'd make it. I thought the gimmick might be sheep shagging. X. Not many people would stop by a settlement run by our schools. Yeah, that would be bad. Aw. What about uh, the nerf herders? Just keep your distance, ghouls, and everything will be fine. Ah, zombies! And then, hey, always cool to be ghoul, you know what we mean? Which, like, that's the positive one, but also, guys, I realize that Fallout Shelter is maybe not the place you're looking for, uh, you're looking for places to, uh, learn real lessons about systemic racism in our culture, but, uh... There's a neutral response here positively that... Positively patronizing. Yeah, it's positively patronizing. Like, there's... There's no reason to even go into, uh... the difference between ghouls and human beings at this particular point in the conversation. They say, you know, I didn't think you would, uh... Didn't think anybody would visit a uh, a place run by a schools, and then you just say, "Well, what's going on, guys?" That's just just continue on with the dialogue, man. I mean, I guess between being offensive and ignorant, being offensive and ignorant, but at least aware of the concept of what ghouls are. Everyone learns the difference between boys and ghouls someday, Bobo. Oh. I dunno, vivisection is pretty important work, and will definitely tell me the differences. <laughs> Lethal, the difference between boys and ghouls? What about those that are, uh, what about those that are non-binary? Anyways, it's cool to be ghoul, you know what we mean? Like, cool, let's make you ghouls. Ha, <laughs> you're alright, smooth skins. Take this. Now they point to their crotches. Dang! It's real cool to be ghoul. Somewhat ghoulish. You mean bulls? No, we don't know what you mean. Ghastly. Vowels. Alright, so we talked to the settlers. We got a couple of extra Nuka Colas out of it. Easy to ask, Moose Skins. We know what we look like, but we're peaceful. We're happy to trade with your vault. Let's send you back with a nice gift. What do you say? Um, I told the last guy is always cool to be cool, but. Thinking about it, though, Bobo, you could make the case that all ghouls have transitioned. X. X. A gift of death. A gift of death. Come on now. 
Uh, weapons, anything you can spare. We need some outfits, something stylish, medicines if you've got it. Crafting supplies, all the junk you got. Last time when we got crafting supplies, we got a giddy up buttercup, which is a legendary piece of junk. So if they're giving out great junk when uh, these situations come up, I am glad to take it. Crafting supplies, all the junk you got. Sounds good, smooth skins. A globe. Hmm. Stay alert. I got gray junk, if you know what I mean. So there's all this left to explore, but technically the mission is over. But you know, we we'll want to uh, we'll want to kill a bunch of uh, mole <laughs> mole rats first. I've had really good luck with weapons in this run. Uh, speak of Cao Cao, and he will appear. Um, there is the plasma rifle. A perfectly intact, non-rusty plasma rifle. You have the regular Gauss rifle. You are the one with the rusty Gauss rifle, so take a regular plasma rifle. I guess every time I go into a room and I'm about to click on treasure, I should note, hey, I've been having good luck with weapons. Okay, let's try it. Any thoughts? Yeah, you know, we've been having really good luck with weapons this run. Scribe robe. Uh, not exactly super worthwhile, but uh, that's okay. Even boss radroaches cannot survive. Some pretty Game lame handguns. That's alright. At least the game's paying attention, man. Ald, are you talking about Terrapin Wares? See how fast I am at Chad. LOL. Dang, we got four Nuka-Cola Quantums in just this mission. And the mission's not over. I don't know if this is just a particularly good area because it's a daily quest and they just like to give good gear in the daily quest, or if we're just lucky. In this one particular go-round. Let's show these losers what Vault teamwork looks like. We've had good luck with weapons. Is that an advanced radiation suit or just a regular radiation suit? It's a regular radiation suit. It can still be useful. Hey, stop fighting up there. All you go all you smooth skins are alright. Alright, by the time I can figure out my way over the critical hit. You and I wish I didn't. Why are you guys being so cruel to one another? Ooh, that's fast. Two and a half damage. It's a little slower. Still two and a half damage. Wow, humans really did screw things up, royalty. All 
All right, let's uh, stim pack you up. You just leveled up, so you don't need any. And we'll stim pack you up because we're about to go back, and I think we're at or near our limit. And did we explore every little thing in this building? We sure did. We talked to all the settlers, and we were nice to them. Got some theme recipe fragments and four frickin' Nuka-Cola Quantums. So let's get back to the vault, because that's a success. And that's a spinning sign of warning of radiation. Hey, we accomplished that big goal, everybody. Yes, I understand that uh, we're badly short of resources because I've been away for a while and I didn't get to click all these things. Now let's get you back into your sports fan outfit because we have done enough. All right, let's see which diner has the smallest number of people in it. That one has that one has 5. So it's probably doing all right. Do I have the two diners? This one only has 3. So let's get you up here. Let's also get you a weapon because the raiders are about to attack. I mean, you're not going to stay when we get there anyway, but, uh... Here, why don't you use this flamer? I know, you're going to run away anyway, but, uh... If you're going to be a part of this room, you may as well get good weaponry. Right? Come on, guys, you could be making food. I mean, obviously they can't be up here. They're too busy shooting at these guys. Take a look at our quest list. Took care of that. Let's perform six critical hits. Can't do that right away. Enhanced assault rifle recipe. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so mush-mouthed lately. That's the soul of recipe. Let's go on an adventure. You're pretty strong. We could use some strong folks down here in the nuclear reactors because we keep running low on energy. You don't have any especial skill. Um, we could make you a strong one. Shaker McGee. I'm also going to put you down here in the nuclear plant. Because I would like to get those running a little faster. And uh, you, you're the new kid in town. Or one of many new kids in town, aren't you? Let's... Uh, do we have a sturdy vault suit or just an armored one? Okay. Let's get you an armored vault suit and put you to work in one of the water treatment stations, even though they're doing pretty well.
and food. See, the raiders came here to take food, but uh, the main thing that they really did was just slow us down. Now then. We have to sell junk. I don't know that selling this rusty hunting rifle will count. I could always recycle it and then sell the junk I get from it, but let me just try selling it. That count towards our goal? No. Okay, I'll just sell the junk then. The real thing they did was aggressively deliver an assault rifle recipe. Might not get <laughs> junk though. Yeah. Oh no, no junk. Delivery for you, sir. And yes, I am collecting this up, but uh, I want to see what we have the most of out of all this junk. Got a toy car. Check that out. I probably shouldn't be selling all those weapons because I'm pretty sure we still have some unarmed vaulteers, but... Uh, And importantly, how much is in your trunk? What? What do you think I'm going to do with all that? Junk, all that junk inside my trunk. So we have 24. No, we're not selling all 48. There you go, sold four pieces of junk. Congratulations, me. Now what else do we need to do? Kill four rad scorpions without a weapon. Haha, <laughs> bye-bye. Oh, it hasn't been 24 hours yet. I guess we're keeping that uh, objective for a little while longer. all the uh, super smart people in here, it shouldn't be that big deal to rush. But it is. Quick, everyone, un unarm yourselves. You'll kill the rad scorpion easily. Okay. Thanks, Rad Scorpion. Odds should be low that it's a problem. There we go. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and realize that we are a little bit short on resources. But somebody did just level up their agility, so that's great, right? And we're short on power, but uh, they'll deal. They'll manage. They'll be strong. They'll try to hang on. I'm going to go ahead and call this one an episode for Fallout Shelter, though. So let me say so long to YouTube, and let me say what stay tuned. What has Tower ever done for the vault, anyway? Yeah, right? And uh, let me just say stay tuned for the stream.
We'll be right back in a moment with the next chapter of <laughs> Bobo's Sandwich Streams. <laughs> 